Hello, today I'm going to show you how we change the gloves on the glove box. So we already did this one previously. Uh, you can see it's still a little bit white from the powder. This one here is uh, used for a long time. So you just go in in the glove box um, and you will find there's this additional door that we keep in here. And you want to use this to block off this side just by turning the knob get really tight uh, when you go out you will see that the glove that you cut off it will not refill anymore that's a good sign so then you just need to remove the two rubber o-rings that are on here these are pretty old, so we have actually new ones that we can use, uh, but it's okay to reuse them for some time. <clears throat> so there's a little, let's call it a built-in o-ring here on the glove that is in this last crease. And you can just take the whole glove off. This is a little bit scary. There's all this dirt in here that accumulated we can even see maybe some glass shards these are of course uh, the parts that can really damage the glove and we want to clean this part out while we're here so we successfully took off the uh, glove here and we cleaned all this part out and now we have to really think about to use the right glove so in this case we already attached the left one but let's say you still have both. What you can do is you look at this writing. This goes on the inside. So this is how it should look. The, the thumb should point to the left. And when we want to attach this, there will be some air going in, but we want to keep the air to a minimum. And for that, we'll just roll up the whole glove. You just need to um, keep in mind which part is up and which is down. Roll it tight, press some of the air out, and then stick it in so that up is still up. And you fold, fold this over. and put this built-in o-ring in the last crease. All right, now there's still a lot of air in, the glove, in, in this glove, you can see it, right? So in order to, to minimize that a little bit, open up the glove at the top and just press out as much air as possible will never be perfect and we will definitely uh, flush the box after that and also do a regeneration. So finally you take the uh, two rubber o-rings, these are new ones, and put them in the two other creases. Like so. So finally you need to get in the glove box again and open the door from the other side. And the moment you have it open, the glove will already unfold. We'll need a little bit of help the first time. This is how you change the gloves on the glove box.